Hi guys, um, this is a look that was requested by a couple people on, um, let me put this down one sec, there we go, on, um, Electric Eel, and what they had said is that they didn't know how to, um, they didn't know how to use it, because it's kind of like, like I find with this color it's not a light light blue, yet it's not, um, it's not a dark like crease color either so they thought maybe so I'm just gonna do a look on how on one of the ways I use it um, I'm probably going to do another video on how to use it in a different way but the look that I have right now hopefully you can see that is um, is how I use it whenever I'm doing it like brightly so yeah um, let's start so yeah, what I had already done is I already applied Urban Decay Primer Potion on this eye. Um, I was a doofus and accidentally put the yellow stuff on as well, until I realized I wanted to do this eye first. So um, yeah, just put Urban Decay Primer Potion on, and then what I do is I take Max Chrome Yellow, which is looks like this. And for this look, we're only using two eyeshadows. I know. Like, you would think that there's more, but there's only two. So just take the yellow on an eyeshadow brush so it looks like this. And what you want to do is you want to just pat it on. And then just taking that brush, just blend it out. But it looks like that. Alrighty. So then what you want to do is taking your electric eel, which is like a bright, bright, bright blue, um, just taking the crease brush, and this isn't like a MAC brush or anything, this is just like a tiny crease brush, but it's like a curved brush and then it's tapered on the top, so you can see that. And it works really well for getting like right in the crease. And just take this on your brush, and just get a little bit on the end of it. Now, you wanna, what I do is I start and I put a dot right here. So it looks like that, I know it looks crazy. And then just lightly, very lightly, just go right into the crease with that. See now because you're doing it really lightly what it does is it mixes with the yellow and creates almost like a green so that it's almost like a gradient effect only you're using two eyeshadows so that's cool. Just get a little bit more in your brush and just go back. And then just put some of the blue just right on the outside. It looks like this. Hmm, crazy. So then taking that same eyeshadow brush, just want to take that and kind of blend it into the yellow. So then what I do is I take just a tiny little brush and black track fluid line and I just line my eye
So I kind of screwed that up, like right there, but. Again, if you're better at it, you look better. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, see, this one looks really good. This one doesn't look good. But it takes practice. That's not too bad. It looks like this. So then what I do is I take um, Max Graph Black Technical Liner and I just line the bottom. And do the waterline as well. It looks like this. So then what I like to do, because you're basically essentially done, is take a little tiny tiny brush and just go back with the electric eel, like that, and then just go right in here, just to add more of that blue color. And then you don't have to do this, but I like to do this, is just take this and you go right underneath. And then all I do is I just take mascara. This looks like this. And that's all you do. And that's one of the ways I use um, electric eel. Um, if you don't have the MAC yellow, or the, you could probably use um, NYX yellow. I don't know how well it would work, but it might work. Um, yeah. So that's my look using electric eel. Hope that helps. Um, and then for cheeks, I would just take like, this is just an old blush of mine. And then for lips, because you don't want to do anything too crazy. This is just like lip balm stuff. Is I'll use Max Cream Sheen in Speed Dial, which is a new color. It's awesome. So light pink. That's my look. Hopefully you like that. Bye.